As months pass, more mutations of COVID-19 are being discovered. The latest in headlines is the Mu variant. Five cases are found in Dallas County. Right now, it's a uh, defined by the World Health Organization as a variant of interest. Dr. Philip Huang with Dallas County Health and Human Services says Mu isn't the highest here. Delta variant is the predominant uh, variant, you know, or uh, strain circulating. Uh, this is not. At that level. But no matter which COVID variant, it is still a race to get people vaccinated before the virus mutates more. We know that the more people that are infected, the more ability there are for new variants to form. So it's another reason to get vaccinated and to prevent infection. Dr. Beth Kasanoff Piper is president of the Dallas County Medical Society. She says some variants can be more aggressive. Delta took off rapidly and scientists are watching the mu variant to see what it'll do. In the meantime, do everything you can to protect yourself and to protect those around you. As of Wednesday, Parkland Hospital has around 250 COVID patients. It is actually almost exactly the same already as the peak we had back in the wintertime. Dr. Joe Chang is the chief medical officer. He says from a frontline standpoint, whether a patient has alpha, delta, mu, or some other variant. It doesn't really make much difference to us uh, because the medicines and the treatments don't change. What does make a difference is stopping the spread as hospitals and healthcare workers are overwhelmed. I don't know how they keep coming back day after day, uh, except that they are truly, truly dedicated to this patient population and serving these patients that come in from Dallas County. I can't be more thankful for them. In Dallas, I'm Tiffany Liu.